Hello everyone, this is Plank Time. I'm going to be talking about the September 23rd, 2017 Revelation 12 sign in Virgo. And I'm also going to be talking about the same sign that showed up about 6,000 years ago in the year 3,973 BC. As you can see here, this is the September 23rd one this year. And Jupiter looks like it leaves this line here if you're going by that line. But I, I don't always go by that line because um, it's Virgo is drawn different ways over the years. People have just drawn it different ways. Sometimes like a stick figure. Sometimes they add this part in differently. The feet are different. Um, if you use a if you use the line like across like this, it would be fine. Or if you use it like this, you'd be fine too, because it actually leaves in September September 11th, which is. Oh, that's kind of ironic, September 11th, I didn't even think of that. But yeah, September 11th, it, it looks like it leaves, and then it's a little further out during the um, during the, the sign of the clothes in the sun, moon at her feet, 12 stars above her head, 9 in Leo, 3 planets, and she's giving birth to Jupiter. That's, that's the sign right there on that date. Now I'm going to be talking about I'm going to go into this one here. This is the uh, the one that happens in 3,973, but it enters in 74 on September 23rd. Just like the one this year, that one exits on September 23rd. This one entered on September 23rd. And then it's Jupiter looks like it comes out on uh, October 31st, which is actually Halloween, but um, not back then, obviously. But it goes even it goes even further out. I think it's uh, January January first, three thousand nine hundred seventy three BC. It goes pretty f far out, and you would think, oh well, it leaves. Uh, no, not if you go by this line here. If you were to draw it like this, you'd be you'd be fine. And then it ends up going back, and we end up getting a meteor shower there. It's uh, the zero Virginians meteor shower, and it. it when the first time it appears is it's inside Virgo, and then it goes for a little while to May, May 23rd, and that's the last day of it right there, the, the uh, meteor shower. Here's the date of it. This is July 28th, July 28th, 3973 BC. It's pretty much almost exactly like the one that we're going to have this year. It's even got the line like, Doom. it's the sun, clothed in the sun. It looks like it might be a little on Leo, but it's not. It's all the way in Virgo if you look in Stellarium, which I was using. And it's right here. And the moon, moon is at her feet, just like this year. 12 stars above her head, just like this year. The only difference is, here you have Venus, Mercury, and Saturn. The one this year, 2017, it's Mercury, Mars, and Venus. And... Venus is a little little more over, the sun's a little more over, and the moon's a little more over here. And then uh, Jupiter, gives birth to Jupiter, um, Jupiter's a little further too. It's like right here this year at, at, during, the, during the sign. But if you do that, again, if you do that, boom, you're okay. And then uh, the only real difference is Mars. Mars is um, really close to it, which Mars is the, the god of war. And since this sign appeared, we've had lots of wars since then. And this is about 4,000 years before the prophet, the prophecy was ever put, put down to be in the book of Revelations. You can see the sign a little closer, the Venus, Mercury, and Saturn a little closer here. And then even closer, Saturn. It's awfully close to this one, but that doesn't matter. It's still, still a nice line. As you go. Now I'm going to show you the, the two next to each other. The one this year and the one back then. This is the one back then. In July 28th. You have it. Um, the, the sun, the moon, the stars, Jupiter coming out, and Mars. Here you have it the same thing. You just have the sun over here more back then. The moon is just a little further over here. The planets are different. And uh, Jupiter is over here back then and then Mars. Mars is here. But this year 
uh, that we're having this year. Mars is right there. Here's here's different signs. You can see it's been a stick figure. It's been just they just drawn in different ways. So you can't go can't go exactly by by those lines. I I seen it different a bunch of different ways, but I'm not gonna show you everyone I got. Um, let me show you the, the signs. So here's the, the the sun, the moon, the stars, right here. Revelations 12. A great sign appeared in the heavens. A woman clothed in the sun, with the moon under her feet, a crown of twelve stars above her head, and she was pregnant and cried out in pain. That's exactly that's exactly that sign. And it showed up also in I think it's 3,914. It, it was 15 in the 14. Um, I calculated. The years 3,973 plus 2,017 is 5,990 years, which is just 10 years shy of that 6,000 6, years. And I'm, I calculated I calculated the, the two dates on it from back then. Of course, I had to use a year. I had to use 1980 and 81 because they don't have they don't have BC on here. And it was uh, September 23rd, and then to July 28th. And it's ten months, ten months, five days, exactly forty-four weeks. The one we have, the one we have this year, I also calculated from I believe it's November twentieth, two thousand sixteen, to September or yeah, September twenty-third, two thousand seventeen. Calculated here, and you get ten months, three days, forty-three weeks, and six days. So, just about exactly the same. Um, and a, a pregnancy can be that. It, they say nine months, but it, it can be under that or over that. Ten months, it's not unheard of, especially before they can induce it, you know, 100, 100 plus years ago. Um, they just started, um, 50, 60 years, they started inducing. So, I'm sure back in the day, they went 10 months. They went 10 months all the time. Uh, that's my video. Hope you enjoyed. Give it a thumbs up. This has been Plank Time. See you later.